I love when I can come out with a song that's lyrically makes me feel really good and on top of that, just sonically and melodically really poetic and has lots of imagery. All of those things combined, I think, is what makes it one of my favorite songs that I've ever been a part of. I remember just seeing something about a coffee cup and something about missing somebody. And I always wanted to write a song called Coffee too. It was always just like a little thing in the back of my head. Like that would be a cool song title. So I just kind of jotted some ideas down based on that. All of us kind of got into a room and I just, just literally said, hey, what if you wrote a song called Coffee? And we just sort of wrote down all these different imagery lines and just wanted to make it feel really poetic. I ended up taking the song and just stripping it down and making it just me and a guitar. Just something about the intro and how it's just my vocal and there's a flow to it and it just, it makes me feel like I'm floating and I felt like it'd be a cool way just to open the album with it. I envy the cup of coffee that kisses you every morning. That pillow caressing your cheek when you are tired and yawning. It was really fun because we got to just play with the idea of when you're missing somebody, you kind of feel a little bit crazy. This song for me is about um, missing my now husband at the time we were dating. It was hard because he was all the way in Germany and I was just like traveling everywhere. I'm jealous of the steering wheel you wrap your hands around. That seatbelt's on your chest, here in your heart, holding you down. I envy the cup of coffee that kisses you every morning. Oh. I'm starting to miss you so bad that I'm missing. I'm jealous of people who are near you, and I'm even jealous of like objects that are near you at this point, because your coffee gets to see you more than I do, and that sucks. Yeah, at the end of the day, it was like, what? how many things can we uh, compare this this feeling of like this longing for somebody. How, how many different objects can we throw in and kind of like play with that? Ooh, ooh, I would jump over the edge for you to get to you. Ooh, ooh, I walk in ocean to get to you. Next to you. That line um, is kind of a direct connection to um, to me and my now husband. When we were dating, um, you know, he was in Germany. There was like a literal ocean in between us. So that was kind of a cool line to throw in. It just made it a little more personal. It's unfair cause I'm missing you way too much. I'm missing you, missing you way too much. And I'm wishing you were right here because I'm missing you way, way, way too much. Yeah, it's it's crazy even performing this song live. It's like, I do kind of go back into that mode of like, wow, we were like legit long distance. Like this was wild. And we didn't know, you know, when the next time is that we were gonna see each other. We didn't have any plans sometimes. It would just be like, okay, bye. And then, you know, I have no idea when the next time is gonna be, so I'm glad that chapter is, is over. <laughs> and I know that it's so silly of me to be jealous of all these stupid things, but I'm missing you, missing you way too much, missing you way, way, way too much, and it's unfair. That line is just me, like, complaining, I guess. I'm <laughs> like throwing a fit, you know, this is unfair, I'm over this. Anytime I feel any emotion strongly, I usually kind of like internalize and just get into music mode. It's not even like, oh, I'm jealous of that girl or like I'm, I'm jealous like in a mean way, but more, oh, I just like, they get to be with you. I wish I was taking part in that too, or just they're experiencing something um, that's like new and fun and exciting. You're like, oh, I would love to experience that with you. So it's it's more like any anyone who's around them or anything really is just like, yeah, I'm jealous of that. Am I crazy to wanna hold you like the clothes on your body? Oh, I would trade places with the air that rushes by you so softly. Oh. We all, I think, started with a list. I think once the coffee idea was out there and we kind of got that line down, it was like, okay, then what 
what other, you know, things can we can we do here that's kind of in that same lane? So something that's close to him. So like clothes are obviously like literally on you, you know, the, the air that touches you, like anything that you would wanna like trade places with. That's a fun way to write a song, really. I did that on a couple other songs of the album where it was like, okay, this line is really strong. Let's try and like match it with these other lines. And then we have like all this imagery. You got the things I need, but they're always out of reach. And I always have to dream to get you next to me. And it's unfair, even the stars that shine get to see you at night. It all reminds me of you, and maybe that's the reason why I'm always... What I need is, I'm, I'm very needy. What, I, what I'm referring to in this song, I think, is just simple things like just wanting, uh, needing their, their time and needing their love and affection and um, just their, their presence, their physical presence being near you and just being intimate with somebody in even like emotionally even, you know, just having that I think is important in a relationship. Yeah, it's what, it's what I need. I'm not actually the biggest coffee drinker, which is so sad because I have a song named Coffee. But I want to say it's because I'm a singer. I think the, the caffeine, I've heard, like, dries out your voice. So I'm just going to blame it on that. But especially being a Cali girl, I love iced coffee. So that's, like, that's my thing.